Hello everyone, Aaron here. This is another EMM video. We're going to switch out some RTR. So I just drafted um, earlier today, back on my addiction. Uh, I did Rakdos and I got to the last uh, finals. It's been a while since I won... Uh, a draft actually I think last week really last week or the week before so it's been a while so last four or five drafts have been not positive well it's been okay all right what we got here hello cutors jailbreaker Esperia, Skyline Predator, Explosive Impact. Um, Elocutors is okay. I see people win with that card. Just lock the game down and win with Elocutor counters. Uh, what else is there to pick as a first pick kind of thing? Jailbreaker's not a first pick. The Predators, the two six drops are not a uh, first one. Maybe Explosive Impact is a first pick. I mean, it could get splashed, right? So maybe that's what we take. I don't know. The Elocutors are okay. Hmm, I wish I had a coin to flip. I would do that between the two, but... Maybe Elocutors is the better one. I'll take Elocutors. Here, the best card is... Maybe Void Wielder? I mean, it does stick into the plan of uh, Elocutors. Well, so does uh, Eyes in the Skies. Void Wielder is definitely a better card, though. Alright, let's go with Void Wielder. Got our five drops going. <laughs> Should we go another five drop? Or we're going to, getting too dangerous on the five drops. Stab wins the better card here. Rick's Mod Mod Guild Mage is amazing. Should I just go Rick Mod Mod or Stab Wound? I think Stab Wound's a pick. I could always just splash um, some Trans Guild Promenade for this. If we end up going red black, we could splash the Void Wheeler. It's not really a good splash. Nightly Valor. I think we just take Nightly Valor here, maybe. Mm. I feel like we could have maybe went into Rakdos. Uh, at least the guys to our left are not going to be in Selesnya. Slesnia is so powerful. Uh, we're going to go for Fairy Imposter or Doorkeeper here. We'll go for Doorkeeper. We'll pick up some Doorkeepers. Uh, I don't know if we could actually do the full-out Doorkeeper plan, but Fairy Imposter is not too interesting. Well, neither is Doorkeeper, actually, but it's just a wall, a, lo a low casting cost wall. Uh, here we have another doorkeeper, Axe being Guardian, which is kind of interesting. Uh, I like Inspiration, we can get that later. So I think it's the Axe being Guardian, keep us open. Maybe we could go uh, base green, green white, splat. Maybe, I mean, like, this Void Wielder. Doorkeeper could just not be there, Void would be a splash. Oh, we need some gate creeper vines. We can go up, uh, or another axe maker. We can go some three, four color uh, weirdness. I mean, we have some walls now. So elocutors looking are looking pretty good.
I originally was very afraid of um, drafting blue. I'm still not very confident with blue. I feel like uh, green, white, and uh, Rakdos, I I have the best like uh, best outcomes with those two colors. Oh, Havoc Festival! Crap! I love Havoc Festival. I want to use it one day. Uh, here we could go either Sunspire Griffin or Azorius Guildgate. And I think maybe the Azorius Guildgate we should prioritize. Well, Sunspire Griffin's a good card. But for going more than one color, it's going to be hard to... We'll Guildgate. First pack's going to be a little random. Here there's uh, these three cards. Hussar Patrol, Avenging Arrow, Center Herald. Uh, Centaur Herald I kind of like. I don't like Hussar Patrol very much, to be honest with you. Mm, Centaur Herald, Avenging Arrow. Yeah. Um, just a hard pick. All these cards are pretty good for us. Eyes in the Skies is good. Uh, an action junction is pretty good. Inspiration is good, but we could pick one up later. King Apparition is good, but Eyes in the Skies. Just go Eyes in the Skies. I feel like those get picked up higher than anything else. Mm. Spiria. Spiria is pretty good, but Final Predator is pretty annoying. we got to get a coin here. i got to get an app that can flip a coin, because I want... I want to flip a coin between these two. Uh, since we are like splashing random color, let's, we're doing band here. I'm just going to go with Spiria since this is one blue. Um, we have one enchantment. So it doesn't really fit the bill too much. Although, Sustainous so Sentry is not that great either. Do we just do some like sphere randomness? We already have so many five drops though. For, uh, yeah, let's go with the sentry. We need some, we need some balls. Not that it's that ballsy, but ruin wing versus stealer. I think we we'll go stealer. Cancel. Yeah, we'll go cancel. Downsize. Ten crash. We're probably not playing that. But, hey, when you have an Axeman Guardian, you know you're not going for colors. <laughs> no, I don't know. Let's see what happens. Let's see what we open up here. Let's hope it's not a black-red card. I should say, I hope it's not a Rakdos card. If it's not black or red, and it's a bomb card, we're definitely scooping it up. Yeah. Um, okay. Well, this is not hide this. Uh, I the cards I like in here are Corpses Accord. Uh, in our colors, that's pretty much it. I mean, I don't want to get another spear for now. I mean, we could pick one up later. Uh, Concordia Pets is, Pigs is pretty good, but I want a Corpses Accord. Pigs is might wheel. Uh, Teleportal's not the kind of card we need. Void Wielder versus Seller of Songbirds. Versus... Well, I don't really want to go very long legs. Gatekeeper Vine, maybe? Void Wielder versus Gatekeeper Vine. I think we can go Gabe Creeper Vine. We can have like a base of green, base green card, um, and then like splash a bunch of stuff. So we have to get some more, like, we have some green stuff, some centaurs, Axe Main Guardian, cut the cancel. We can go like Selesnia, or blue white, 
or blue green slash splash white. Cause like the century is not that great. Yeah, we could do like Simic splash white. Just prioritize the um, doorkeepers. We only got one of the doorkeepers. Why, why didn't we pick up the other doorkeeper? I think it, maybe it wasn't. Uh, There's was another huge playable in there. Um, cards in our colors. Uh, the Arc Retriever, which is not too bad, but it's not great either. Uh, Volatile Rig, I actually kind of like. It's dangerous. But. Maybe just Avenging Arrow is better than that. Azorius Gildead. I think removal is better. We have to, we have, you know, if there's nothing, if there's no uh, doorkeepers, well, ooh, Centaur Healer versus Tristani's Judgment. I think Tristani's Judgment is the call. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, guys. So I think Tristani's Judgment is the call here. Over a centaur healer. Yeah, uh, we need the removal. Uh, we that does help in the, you know, populate our various populate cards. Soul tithe versus dryad militant. Dryad militant's not very much. Not really a card in this deck, is it? Is it? I think Keening is better than dryad militant in this deck. Soul Tithe. Soul Tithe is removal. Soul Tithe can be very annoying. We only have nine creatures, though. Buy Soul Tithe. Maybe next time. Dramatic Rescue, I think that's a pretty obvious pick here. I would just like love to get an Azorius Guild Gate around again, but I think we just passed one for the Keening apparition. I probably should have taken the Guild Gate. Actually, that was kind of pro probably kind of stupid. Yeah, get as many Azorius Guild Gates as possible, and I think I put a bunch of green in there, base green, so we can actually get these stuff, this stuff going. So we have one um, win condition. We need some more flyers, probably. I'm, I, we didn't take the griffin because of what? <sighs> uh, doorkeeper versus centaur versus songbirds. I think here we have to take a healer. I like healer quite a bit. I've already said this on the on the videos. Ah oh, man. But doorkeeper. One, two, three, four. We'd have four defenders. It's tech it could be um a win con. And it blocks healers. Nah, who am I kidding? Doorkeeper's not as good as Center Healer. Not even close. Uh right, here's between the Vassal Soul and the Skywatch. I think we need some more flyers early game, maybe. And because we're doing blue-white, Vassal Soul actually just becomes a better card. Uh, I get to take a Skywatch. Horncaller's chance is so bad. I'll take Common Bond. I don't... I don't think we're going to play Common Bond, though. I don't know what... This deck doesn't really... We have 13 creatures, but we have no, like, no... Kui. You know what Kui is? It's balls. Dispel? Yeah, I could use a Dispel. Main deck of Dispel. Army Guard kind of actually works in this deck. Poop out heavy four power guy, uh, four toughness guys that you know can block centaurs all day long. That is a good idea. Got this interesting wave. 
I don't know what's going on in this deck. So we didn't prioritize Dork Keeper, because I'm an idiot. But I mean, we got Centaur Healer instead. We probably should have went to Door Keeper. I passed two Door Keepers up. We could have had two more Door Keepers, and then that's definitely a win condition. Uh, and I passed up... Um, Yeah, that's what I passed up. I passed that up. That could have been a win con. Alright, cross Sherry, hide that. Chain Caracol, pretty bad. Dead Ridge Goliath, yeah, I think we gotta take that. It's pretty heavy on the uh, green, but... Yeah, what can we do? Palisade Giant, is that good? I don't, I don't even know if that's good. <sighs> There's a lot of good cards in here for us. Uh, Justice here. I don't know if the Justice here actually makes any sense in this deck. Maybe just go all the way. We go Palisade Giant. We just got these like heavy hitters. I've never done this before with these this heavy, heavy esque. Very, very heavy um, bottom end. Maybe eyes in the skies. Brush Trider is also a card. Even Celestia Guildgate. Okay, these are cards we'll never see again. So, Palisade Giant is 6. We could take on an Asperia. I think we take that over that. There's so many good cards in this pack, though. We want Inspiration, too. Let's take the Palisade Giant. Maybe we'll regret it. Oh, my God! Oh, now I'm sad I didn't pick up more Axeman Guardians, because that is such an amazing card. <laughs> no, we're not going to take it. Um, Cordy Pegasus, hold the ground. Um, I don't. Uh, I feel like we should have picked up those uh, doorkeepers before. Now I don't feel like Geekrue Vine's that good anymore. It does let us get to the drop land drops though. Man, we have no nothing. Like we have to get to to six mana to do anything in this deck, and by that time maybe the game's over. I don't know. I guess we'll see, huh? Vassal Soul. So we have one removal, two removal cards, ugh. or flyers. One, two. Slesnia Guildgate. Yeah, I think I'm taking the Guildgate. So if we cut blue actually, we just splash blue. It kind of starts making sense. Yeah, this kind of kind of makes sense. This Selesnya. Selesnya sla splash blue deck. Yeah, Stranic Rescue is pretty good. Would have liked a little bit more removal. 
like a lot more removal, but one, two, two removal cards, void wielder. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, it's a little bit random this deck. Uh, very random, I should say. Very, very random. The curves uh, seems to be better than it was before since I took out the blue. So what do we need now? Just like removal, if there is any removal. Ethereal armor. How many? We have one. One enchantment, so that doesn't really help. Uh, who's our patrol is okay. We have 15 creatures. It's just a paralyzing grasp just to get us another removal card. It's not great, but I know, but uh, it's it's something, right? I think the inspiration is key in here. We got to draw into some of these cards. Uh, Swift Justice versus Slesnia Kieran. Slesnia Kieran is probably the card, huh? yeah. I have yet to lose um, like three games in a Swiss, so this might be the one. <laughs> we'll have to see. I'm not too. Wow! What? Um. Okay. Maybe his Zorius arrest uh, justice here. Sounds fire Griffin so good. Maybe we need some delay just this year. Just this year really just slows the game down. That's kind of what we need. Elgari Long Legs is a pretty good card. Yeah, I'll take another Paralyzing gra Grass. This is Justice. That's just your fan favorite, Swift Justice. Okay, let's see if we can't make this a little bit more aggressive than it looked like in the early part stages of this uh, draft. Okay, Center's Herald. Gaker Vine, not very uh, aggressive. Pegasus, King Apparition, Removal. Eyes in the Skies, Justice here, Nelly Valor. Elocutor is our win con condition. Okay, so these are the cards that I'm pretty sure I want to have in this deck. We're at 27, they cut 4. Courses of Court is better than Palisade Giant, I think. We cut a Long Legs. Palisade Giant. I think the the doorkeeper is a good idea. Maybe one gate creeper vine is enough. Fourteen creatures is very low. We have one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five ish removal cards. 
Pegasus is just to stop the the onslaught. Happy we got Deadbridge Goliath. I feel more, much more safe with him around. I like the Asperia and uh, Void Builder. I like all these cards. Got a lot of blue cards. It was supposed to be a splash. And get rid of one of the Paralyzing Grasps. Does Doorkeeper even make sense? It's like a bad uh, lobber crew. Play two. Still a lot of blue. We have the Azorius Guild Gate. We have the Gate Crew Vine, the Axeman Guardian to help us out for blue. I think three more, three more, three islands would be fine. Just have to add a card. Armory guard. Those are four drops. Four drops are pretty thick. Maybe, maybe we do need to get a group of vine. Maybe uh, no, we don't want to cancel. Cancel is way too intensive. Maybe swift justice just to get us through. That's a little trick. Um. One less island in there. Yeah, I think that uh, it's kind of weird. I th man, these heavy hitters would be nice, though. How how good or bad is Palisade Giant? I know that Golgari Longlegs is pretty intense when he comes down. And take out the Swift Justice? Not too sure. Six. We gotta get those land drops, but because of that, we have our Greek ruin. We'll sw we'll side in Swift Justice. We'll see how close the games are to. Um, uh, we have a lot of five and six drops. Gotta prioritize. I think that long legs is the least important one. But yeah. Thirteen creatures though. Need more creatures. Oh, let's just go with it. Let's see what happens. I'll see you guys around one.